So it all started with a conversation with Mr. Zach Lund, who mentioned it that he makes a really good chili. And I, I just looked at him and I said, I bet my chili's better than yours. And this eventually turned into French Bureau's first annual chili cook-off. And it was really kind of his idea supported by the, the select board. We got people together and I'm really happy with that, how it turned out. Looks like we have some good competition. I don't know, I, if I were you guys, I'd start eating that chili. That's what I might start doing. So we have a prize for best chili, a prize for best side dish, and then also a prize for best name. My name is see no chili, hear no chili, eat some chili. Other than the tender love and care that's put into it, I would say the habanero peppers it really makes my chili warm the soul. Yours is the first one? Yeah. Yours is really hot. It is. It is. I, it is. Maple syrup. So if you haven't voted yet, this is your last chance to vote. Please get your votes in and then we're going to start tallying them up. So now we're going to Long Island Legendary Chili in first. Okay. Second is the March. Okay. And then fries for first. Third, double beam. Okay. Double beam. Five, five, four, seven. Now we have and we'll start with fourth place for the chili. March Madness. First place, Long Island. Oh, I'm totally happy. I knew it was the best chili. Just glad everyone saw it my way and voted exactly how I felt. <laughs>